Hey YouTube, second YouTube video ever here. And the question of the day is, how safe is a scroll saw? In my opinion, it's one of the safest machines that you can run in your house or your shop. And I'm gonna go through a couple examples and show you firsthand what it looks like if your finger makes contact with the blade. Let's take a look. All right guys, we're back. And we're looking at a couple blades here underneath a, a microscope with the light here so that you can see the detail. Now you can see those hooks do get pretty sharp, don't get me wrong. But when I come over here to the blade that's installed on my scroll saw, it's got a little bit of give to it. Well, that give there is there for a couple different reasons. One is to make tighter corners and ability to kind of move with the wood. And so you always want to make sure you're not pushing up against the blade when you're scroll sawing. But I like to think of it also as a safety. So if my finger gets here, that it's not gonna be a hard stop like a table saw or a band saw would be. It's got a little bit of give here. And these teeth aren't nearly as big to catch your finger like a band saw would be. And it's not moving as fast as a band saw or a table saw. So really, if I put my foot down, I'm putting my finger on the blade as we speak. I'm putting my fingernail on the blade as we speak and I'm not getting cut at all. Does that mean that this blade is dull? No, it's really not. I've only used it on a couple cuts. I just recently switched it. So it just means that the blade's not moving fast enough and these teeth, these individual teeth that you see, aren't catching my skin and throwing it down and, and causing it to basically just run right over my finger. And you, I put it on my thumb for I don't know how long, and I don't even have a mark to show for it. That just shows that these blades and the scroll saw can be a really safe machine for a younger kid, a young adult, or an older person that wants to get into woodworking. So if you're worried about the scroll saw being a dangerous machine, it's really not. The only thing that you really need to be careful of is probably this small dust. And it affects some people worse than others. And also different woods affect you differently. So anytime you're cutting on the scroll saw for long periods of time or even short periods of time, make sure that you have a mask on, um, especially with some of those harsher, harsher woods that we tend to cut with sometimes. That's the tip of the day, and I hope you enjoyed the episode. Thank you, guys.